my dear friends and welcome to my channel today I am running errands so I'm just gonna be taking you with me right now I am heading to the post office so I just got here so I am sending out a package to my friend Rosita and she lives in Pennsylvania so I will see you inside it's actually pretty big for it to be a small town. I guess because it is a small town, we need a big post office. So I am sending a small package here. So let's go ahead and do this. Okay, so I went in there and I asked the gentleman if I could send the priority mail. And he said yes, so I grabbed the label. And I asked him if I can go ahead and use the bag that I already had, well, the packaging. And he said, sure. And he said, but you have to send the priority mail. I'm like, okay, duh. But um, then he said, no, you don't have to. You can send the regular mail, but you would have to purchase some um, labels. So I said, okay, where are they? And then I said, oh, man, I could have just used the labels I have at home because I have labels. So he said, oh, okay. He goes, well, that's how they get you. I'm like, really? You're going to tell me that's how they get you? you at the post office. We already think a certain way about you. And you're going to tell me that's how they get us? Well, anyways, I guess he felt bad for whatever he said. Or maybe he saw the look in my face. I'm not sure. Because every time I go somewhere, I always make sure that I lift my shades and I put it on top of my head. Because I like to make eye contact with people whenever I go to businesses. But anyways, he went ahead and made labels for me. He just grabbed pieces of papers and he put to and from. So, Rosita, if you watch this, you're going to see some ghetto labels because he felt bad. So, he didn't charge me for labels. So, I only paid for actual um, delivery, shipping. So, I didn't have to pay for labels, but... I just didn't like the fact that he said that's how they get you you know we already feel some type of way so that's what happened so anyways I sent it out he says she'll get it on Monday so that's a good thing all right I will take you to my next destination so I'll talk to you later okay people my next stop it is Dunkin Donuts I'm gonna place my order now. Hello, James. Um, can I get a medium hot coffee, extra cream with three Splendas? Medium hot, extra cream, three Splendas. What else can I get? Um, can can I get a bacon, egg, and cheese wrap, please? All right. What else can I get for you? Um, that'll be all. All right. Thank you. All right. Yes, my fix. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, that's exactly what I needed. Well, I'm going to go ahead and eat my wrap because I can't eat and drive and drink. And I will see you at my next destination. This is a little bit of what it looks like in my small town. Yeah, not a lot of businesses, a lot of green lots and lots of green just thought that I would show you okay so my next station is that I need to send an a FedEx so you're going inside with me I'm not sure if I'm gonna complete the whole transaction with you guys but I am sending this box right here because they sent me the wrong okay so I am done with FedEx was well, actually a, a male um, a male and more so they do a little bit of everything we don't actually have a FedEx here so they actually handle like UPS FedEx and post office stuff and they also do like printing but anyways so I go in there and I take the original um, box where the ink came in and I told her I wanted to send it and she says it's gonna cost me $22 and I'm like $22 that cost me more than what I originally paid for the shipping 
As a matter of fact, the shipping was actually free, but then I paid to get it for two days. So I was like, oh my gosh. So then she said, well, can I open the box and maybe we can fit it into a priority mail envelope? I said, sure. So we were able to do that. So we were able to reduce the cost to $10 and change, so $10 and 95 cents. So I'm like, okay. I'm like, what is wrong with these people? I'm like, where did they get off? I mean, I, I mean, they're sending packages everywhere anyways. I mean, that is ridiculous. She tried to say that because of the company that we're, that they're being sent to, that they're well known or something like that. And that's why it costs so much. And I'm like, well known, if it's well known, then it should cost less. I'm like, ay, ay, ay. But anyways, it's sent. They said they'll get it by Tuesday or Wednesday the latest. So hopefully once they get it, I can get my refund back and I can enjoy some money. All right. Well, um, this is it. So we went to the post office. Um, we went to Dunkin' Donuts. Then we came here to the mail place for the FedEx. And um, next, I may stop. I'm not sure. But I may stop at the Dollar Tree, which is um, around the corner from here, because I'm actually at St. Mary's. I live in Kingsland, but St. Mary's is about 8 to 10 minutes away. So I'm going to check to see what that Dollar Tree have um, before I head home. All right, so I will see you at the Dollar Tree. All right, guys, wish me luck. I'm putting myself on a budget. So they kind of seem to have the same fall stuff don't see anything new same flowers I just walked by I just walked by and saw this and I thought this was cute it's actually a party plate and it has shells on it and I'm a shells freak I love beach theme so I am here in the craft area but again I don't really see anything new Not really much here either. The only thing I do see that I haven't seen before is these little lights, little posts. Like the little lights that they have on the homes. So that's pretty cute for DIY, DIY, excuse me. That's about it. Mom, they do have quite a few Halloween stuff. different color and miniature lights and they do have these so these are pretty cute so the little tea lights and the Halloween I am going to pick one of these up only because I've seen um, bargain Bethany and I believe I'm um, cruising with Crystal and a few more YouTubers grab it and I haven't seen them have any issues or had them complain so I'm gonna go ahead and try it out cuz the E6000 is kind of expensive so I'm over here in this section where they have all the baskets and different sizes and colors and I'm gonna go ahead and look at some of those um, even if I don't like the colors I can always go ahead and paint them and do something else with them I think these are pretty cute. Live every moment, laugh every day, and love with all your heart. That's pretty. Those are the only ones that I see with wording on it. All 
right, so I'm done. I didn't pick up too much stuff, but I will show you when I do my next haul. All right, I'll see you in my next destination. All right, so my next stop is here, when dixie I have to pick up some milk because my stepkids are coming over today and I don't have any. So here I am. I'm just going to grab a half gallon because we don't really drink regular milk. We drink almond milk, but I'm just picking this up for the kids. But either way, um, we only get 0% for them as well. All right, there we go. All right, so I'm done in there. I got some milk and then I ended up getting some bread as well. I just passed by there and noticed that I needed some. So I got some just to get that out the way. And um, so I'm done with my errands. So I'm just gonna go home for a little bit and chill because I have a massage appointment. I'm looking forward to it. Actually, it was booked, so I had to wait almost a month for it and I need it because I've been stressed out and my back has been hurting and so much needed. So I'm looking forward to it. So until later, thank you so much for watching and for coming with me to run my errands and I will see you next time. And if you like my video, give me a thumbs up, go ahead and subscribe click that little bell for me and then that way you can go ahead and see anytime that I upload. You guys have a great day.